guys, um, Savage Crom here, and um, welcome to It's My Life 8. Sorry it's a day late for you guys, but I was really busy yesterday with homework and stuff like that, and I was playing with my friends on Xbox, because um, you know, I am human. So anyway, um, without further ado, before I start with the story, let me just tell you about the gameplay. I'm not actually watching it at the moment because it's still rendering, but um, it's by my cousin's friend Stewie, who's now my friend. He's called Sacred Trick. You'll see his name in the... Um, like uh, on the kill feed and things like that and he's playing with his friend Wilzo Philzo Will um, so if you want to uh, go to add them on Xbox obviously you'll see their gamer tags um, I don't know if they've got YouTube channels but if they do um, I'll find out and I'll tell you guys to subscribe so without further ado what I'm going to do is because this episode um, actually on my previous episode my It's My Life 7 I got a few like submissions for what I should do so I thought, you know what, because I only ever get like one submission on each video, I'll do a short stories episode where I basically answer um, or like, you know, tell stories about the three of the things which people um, commented on. Um, so what I'm going to do now is just up, um, load up that video and look in the comments and see um, what is my life things. And also my friends told me some at school, but um, I'm mainly going to be looking at the ones that... Um, that uh i got commented on so um I'll, I'll just type that into youtube now and load that up um so while that's waiting just in case you guys uh don't know how i do this basically i record my gameplay on my game capture um and I, what i do is I, I convert it to an mp4 um and then once i've done that or like while it's doing that i'll be recording my um I'll be I'll, I'll be recording my game uh, my commentary and once everything's done then I'm going to uh, I'm I'm gonna oh here's my video uh, I'm just gonna like put it onto my Mac and um, edit it all on that and um, pre Adobe Premiere Pro so without further ado let me do the first one so the first thing is by Rig Gamer um, or RLG Gamer. And, um, and he says, funniest thing that's ever happened to me. Um, now, the funniest thing that ever happened to me, um, I, I don't know if this is really embarrassing or, like, it's just funny, but... Oh, this is uh, going to be hard on. Um, I, I, I'd have to say, the funniest thing that's happened to me, um, what's, you know, it hasn't been embarrassing or anything like that, it's just, it's happened and I've just, like, proper laughed about it. Um, would probably be when I was, I went paintballing and, and it was quite funny at the time. It wasn't funny at the time, but it, I laughed about it. Um, I went paintballing with my friend who was in my year at school and he was, he was like on the other side of the paintball map somewhere. And I was like with this guy and the guy went, okay, it's all clear around there. Um, you go ahead. So I went like... Uh, around there and basically where that was there was like a container um where you could hide behind and as i walked around there two guys popped up from behind the container and just sprayed me and i got hot in the privates a few times everyone was laughing and once the pain had gone down i was laughing too because i it doesn't sound funny but if you had to be there to actually like see it because it, it was so funny it was like so quiet and then like, they just popped up and like shot me loads um so that that was pretty funny um another funny thing would probably be when i went bowling uh quite recently actually and um we were doing the if you saw the video of ben and ted dancing when we we're on the dance machines we were doing um guitar hero and things like that but i was playing uh, my friend nathan on a driving game and we were like driving and he was in the lead for like the whole thing and right at the end he um he crashed and i just like went past him like really slowly just like hey nathan what's up and then just like put my foot on the accelerate and I like went past and you started like laughing like absolutely tons um but if any you guys have seen my previous episodes you know like funny things what have happened what I've been embarrassing and, and I've laughed at afterwards that's quite a hard one because um I, I've mentioned a lot of the things um previously uh so the next one would be let's have a look here um uh, somebody said what about embarrassing moments and I was like I've already done that one um, uh, worst things I've ever done, like the stuff that got me into deep trouble. This is from Jake, because Zodiac for the whim. And I'm going to be perfectly honest with you guys. I, like, never get into trouble. I'm a goody two-shoes. Um, I don't get in trouble at school, but I thought I could do the things where I get 
like what I could tell you guys um about my friends getting into trouble. So basically, what I mean by this is um, well, I, I, about two years ago, I was in no yeah at uh, 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 Christmas time in year seven or Christmas time in year eight. Uh, basically last year, uh, this time last year, around about well not this time last year, but anyway, um. We were having a Christmas lunch, because that's what you do at my school, like, at Christmas time we have a Christmas dinner. And my friend came over, and he was like, and and basically, if the thing at our school is, if you're, like, bad behaved at lunchtime, um, they put you on litter duty. Um, basically, what that is, is you have a plastic bin bag, and you go around with, like, the tongs, like, um... Uh, do you know, like, the grabby claw arm things, but, yeah. Um, and you go around and you just pick up any litter, and if there's stuff on the table, just put it all into a bin um, or a bag. For, and you do that for, like, 10, 15 minutes. And my friend, one of my good friends came over, and, and he was with a bin bag and a prongs, and I was like, uh, why, have, why are you on litter duty? And it turned out that another person was on litter duty, and he got put on litter duty for taking the mick out of someone on litter duty. <laughs> So he was in, like, trouble for making fun of another person who was in trouble. Um, now, I, I wouldn't say some of these were, like, some of my friends, but uh, back in year seven, me and my friend Will, who you'll know, who like, I'm actually going to be playing with today, and I'll be calling a live uh, zombies commentary, um, we were walking out of the, I like, toilets, um... Cause just being for a pee, you know, casually. And um, we saw this guy like, outside, and he bit this guy's arm. And this guy who bit him was like, he's mental, okay? He's like, I don't know, but he bit this guy's arm. And this woman was telling him off, like, what? He like, you know, he just has tetanus jab and stuff, tetanus, tetanus, blah blah blah. And 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 I like saw the guy's face like walk past, and he was like, yeah. And I was like, you must be a vampire or a cannibal. Help! help me so um that that was quite weird and he got him into big trouble because he wasn't allowed to like stay near people for a while you know until his um his hunger for human flesh like went off um so the next thing i'm going to be talking about i got something uh told by my friend at school and um he said if i can remember he said um like um like worst situation or a bad situation that I've been in, and it doesn't have to be like trouble. Um, it can be like you know, like uh, something where you, you had to make a choice or something like that. And basically, um, it was when I was about, I think it was about a year ago, when I had a um, had I, it was like one of my first proper girlfriends, um. And it was around Christmas time. Everything seemed to be around Christmas time. It was around Christmas time, and we were going out like a month, a couple of months. Uh, we, oh, we had been, and we were making each other Christmas cards and stuff. And um, oops, I just knocked someone off. And um, when it came to like the last day of school, when we were giving everyone Christmas gifts. She got me a teddy bear from um, a shop like where I live, um, like with a like a Santa's hat on and a heart, um, saying like I love you or something like that. And I got her, like, a, a box of chocolates. And her friend was like, well, you got her a box of chocolates, and I'm not happy with that. And I'm like, well, I didn't get it for you, so you don't have to moan about it. It's like, you got your bear, and I got your box of chocolates. Um, so the next day, I went to the shop. I, I would just walk around the shops, and I saw the bear she got me. It was in a shop called Home Bargains. The bear was, like, 90, um, 90p? What? Yeah, was it 90p? I don't know. It was, like, it was like 50p, and I was just like... Yeah, whose gifts looking better now? Because I paid, like, five, like, I don't know how much I paid, but I paid, like, quite a bit. It was, like, proper Thornton's nice chocolate, and I got her it, and it was, like, a big box as well. And uh, she was like, yeah, it's it's good, but I think my bear is better. And I was just like, you know what, I don't think this is going to work. I'm going to have to decide whether to, you know, keep going out with you, but, you know, having to deal with your, like, uh, like dumb friend who's really annoying. Or uh, just break up with you and then, like, you know, talk to you as a friend. So I decided to do the right thing and break up with her and just be friends because it wasn't obviously going to work out because um, we were getting told how to run our relationship, basically. Uh, and then later on in that year, or the year afterwards, um, she actually moved to Cyprus. And I was like, okay, hopefully that wasn't due to me. But, like, she didn't go out with anybody else, like, after me. She got out with one of my friends, like, before, like 
through primary and stuff, and, like, into high school. And he wasn't happy that I'd gone out, and I was like, I'm sorry, but, you know, she just, she was just so hot. I'm sorry. Um, so, guys, if you want to leave any comments in the comment section below, um, telling me what I should do next time, um, please. Um, if you want to hear more about relationships, girl stories, and stuff like that, um, then, you know, by all means do that. If no one puts any comments then i'll do that if somebody comments that i'll do that if somebody comments something else i'll do that um but this isn't my life eight i might only do 10 episodes let me know if you want to keep it going or you want to you know stop it there or tell me how many episodes you want me to do obviously i just want to be also putting like other gameplays up as well so and that's pretty much all from me guys hope you like the gameplay it was brilliant and i am out